your pot from Rosie Rivier Engineer. This is my favorite pot. Your brilliant first flop was a raging success. Come on, let's get busy and on to the next. She handed a notebook to Rosie Rivier, who smiled at her aunt as it all became clear. Life might have its failures, but this was not it. The only true failure can come if you quit. Hello, my name is Mahsa Mohake. I'm a computer engineer, lecturer in the School of Engineering, Computer and Mathematical Sciences at Auckland University of Technology. I'm also founder and director of a not-for-profit organization called SheShop. Today I want to tell you my story, how I became an engineer. My story started when I was seven years old. My father took me to one of those hardware computer stores to buy a motherboard for his computer. I remember I was so fascinated with the motherboard, all the tiny electronic component on the board, and all the pins sticking out of the motherboard. I was so fascinated and I was so excited more than actually what you can do with a whole computer. Maybe that was why I started creating and building things since then. And I've been a computer engineer for over 10 years. And funny enough, I'm actually teaching computer hardware technology even today to my students. Engineers love to explore, to try things out and to solve problems. My daughter is just like me when I was young. Curious about how things work, building things and even making piano out of electronics and play-doh. No one is too young to start. Take a sofa apart, learn how they work, fix it, put it back together. But if it didn't work, it doesn't matter. These are all problem-solving skills that they are not taught in school. Don't let anyone tell you you don't know enough. The project is too big or you can't do something. You never know if you don't give yourself opportunity to try it. So engineering is fun. If you really like to find out how different things work, if you're curious, if you love challenges, and if you're a hard worker person, engineering career is the right pathway for you. It's not always easy, but it's always very rewarding to be part of the group that making things to make other people's life easier.